going on YouTube and welcome back to the channel. This is Mike with Living With 3M. See Legend back there, actually got the boat hooked up. The wife and I are going to the lake tomorrow, so I'm getting everything packed up and ready. Uh, but I did notice something about my storm door. I was gonna tell you guys. So if you've ever had a problem with the latch on your storm door here at the house, so this does not involve the truck or the boat. This is a home repair. So looking right here, you got storm door, as you can see right there. And the latch basically just gave up on me. All right, we come over here and you can see that it is not working at all. So the springs or whatever inside, I did repair this unit about a year ago with you can see my dogs in, in the house so uh, but i did come on out girl come on girl oh yeah there's her brother right there everybody say hello to gabriel and abby my goldens okay but basically the internal mechanism and this is a pella p-e-l-l-a pella and i guess that's the brand of the the complete storm door i had to replace the shock uh, about a year ago as well but this unit has just gave up i've already taken it apart and inspected it so it is going to be replaced i ordered the new unit and just a little advice guys do not get an aftermarket unit that is not compatible with the door uh, you you may think it is but it's always best to go back with the original equipment. So this comes straight from Pella with the internal mechanism, screws, and they even include an Allen wrench, which is around here somewhere, but we'll get to that. Okay, first things first, I guess to make it easier, we will prop the door open with the little button. Okay, so that props it open. And now we will... Take, you've got Phillips screws here and here holding the unit on both ends. So we're gonna remove those. Okay, I've removed the top screw and the bottom screw. And you notice there's one right here as well and that will hold this locking mechanism in place. So it's a little longer than the two end ones. So you can see. Okay, once you get those, and this is loose right here you will remove phillips head here and here okay so now with these screws out on the handle i don't know if you can see it but behind the handle right there right there is what we're going to use the allen wrench for to remove the handle and just once that comes off, then the whole unit should come apart. Okay guys, as you can see right there, there's pretty much the entire kit. That's the old unit right there. I have the new unit right here. So hold it right there, as you can see. It's the exact same setup. All right, as you can see, I'm putting the new unit in, is just place it in, and then you got to just work with it to get the screws and everything lined up. Okay guys, I put the screws, which are actually a bolt. I'm sorry, when I say screw, it's a Phillips head bolt about that long. These are back in here and I put my handles on. Also, when you're changing this out, make sure you don't lose these little washers on this assembly. Okay, so I'm gonna push that in. Okay, and now I'll tighten the Allen screws down right here. And I've also got to put the screws, which are screws for this. Yes, put these back in. Okay, this latch assembly, as you can see, it moves in and out. I've already got the bolt with the Phillips head. In that okay all right 
So there you go. That works. You can already tell by just pushing that that it's strong and it's going to work. I've got to tighten the handle down with the Allen wrench and then I'll go ahead and tighten these down right now. All right. Now this last part, this little Allen screw is gonna test your patience. I promise you. Getting in behind the handle to do that. Just take your time and it all should work out well. Okay guys, there it is. You can see both handles move and the entry slide bolt or clip moves with it when you let it go all secure everything works okay so for you do-it-yourselfers at home out there instead of paying a guy to come in and pay him a few hundred dollars to change your locks it can be done so if i can do it anybody can do it so i'm mike living with 3m be sure to check out the channel, like, subscribe. I sure appreciate it. We'll see you in the next video, possibly for that right there. See you guys.